Well, thanks for joining me, Norma. Probably a tough one to chew that loss today. Yeah, it was actually. Our conversion rate on centre passes and long court weren't up to standard, and uh, you know, as you say, you never know what that um, break's going to do for it. It took, took the edge off, I think. The first quarter was fantastic. Even though you were three goals down, the game was, of course, anybody's that early in. But it was the second quarter the Firebirds had that little break. Could you pinpoint what that was? Yeah, I, as I said to you, I think uh, in the talk, uh, we needed Meadows in the game more. And she was, um, you know, not giving us the outside, outside touch. And we needed it on the shot as well. I thought that then picked up and we were able to generate that. But I also felt that we weren't... We were floating off the player too much and needed to nail it. When we did, straight after half-time, we started to pull back some ball again. But, you know, Rimelda certainly, I thought, you know, she pulled the ball in today where she struggled against us the first time and she certainly made a difference on Swifts last week. So hard to beat, but you, you got to play for the one percenters. And I thought we were getting those, but then we would waste the ball. And those turnovers are very crucial in those sort of games. I was going to say that the opportunity was given to you by both the Firebirds who threw some ball away and also I thought Ebony Beckford Chambers again had a hand in a lot of ball just couldn't capitalise today. No, no she didn't and um, I think you know uh, the one bit I got out of it was I thought Ch Chanel Gomez had a great game um, with the hip we knew we'd only get the half out of her and uh, you know would have been great if we'd been able to have her for the whole game but you know that's life and I think though that at least now we know that we might get a bit out of her for the rest of the season but our, um, our defence end often keeps us in it, but it's our tech end that's throwing away the ball. So let me then ask you, Plum, final question. Medhurst was pretty honest in her interview at the end of the game. She's damned if she doesn't, she's damned if she doesn't sometimes. It's just inconsistency for her at the moment, isn't it? Yeah, it is, because I think it got down to, well, listen, if you're not going to shoot the goal, I'll put you on wing attack and I'll put um, Chelsea in the circle. So I think we got a bit of action after that. <laughs> we were waiting for Pittman. <laughs> Sorry it didn't work for you today, but all the best next week. Oh, no problem. Thank you.